Yo, gang, what's good, bro? Yo, what up, kid? You all right? I'm good, but hey, what bring you out here? I feel like we're on the edge of town. I'm looking for a new jogging route. You know what I'm saying? Somewhere out of view of the paparazzi where somebody famous cannot be bothered, you know? You think you could jog around the city and uh, locate something for me? Yeah, look, that ain't going to be no problem, man. Look, I ain't even get my cardio in, so we, we good. I got you. I figured that. Good looking out, bro. Hey, how was it? It was all good, man. You know, ain't no paparazzi, ain't no swarm of fans or nothing, so yeah. we good. All right, cool. Hey, but look, I got a jet. Yeah. Hey, you did good. Yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. Really glad you stopped by, MP. Hey. We've got some fantastic incentive options for you to choose from this time. Cool, what you working with? Here, look at this. Well, that's it for me. I think you chose well. <laughs> Got any questions? Um, I'm good. Thank you All so right. much, Tabitha. Yeah. I'm gonna get out of here. All right, you take, take it care easy. Of yourself. See yep, ya. yep. I see you out there doing work. get to work. Here's what we're gonna do.
Chicago, baby! That's right! And at the midway point, Chris, what stands out about this phase of the regular season to you? Well, usually the standings have solidified, Kevin. The favorites, the cellar dwellers, we had some great stories. And, and this is where the front offices has to take a hard look at their roster and maybe look to make some moves as well. And MP throws it down. And it's inexcusable letting MP get this much speed behind him. You honestly deserve to get dumped at. On the wing, DeRozan. Passes it to Vucevic. And it's sent back by Allen. Okoro kicks to MP. Allen a screen on ball. The drive by MP. And the decisiveness of MP on display. Have to be aware of his ability to knife his way inside. Johnson with a screen on MP. MP against Ball. And it's sent back by Allen. To the middle. Here's Mobley. And Mobley throws it down. What a read from MP. I love how he looks to get it to his open teammates. Johnson with a screen on Sexton. Levine against Sexton. Shot clock at six. And it's sent back by Allen. And how about, and with that great length and awareness, Allen continues to build his reputation as a shot blocker. The drive by MP. Out left of the wing. Now, here's Okoro. Not a lot of room. Fades away. And the shot no good. A bit short. Well, I thought that one was going to go down. Mid-range jumpers. Oh, man, that's usually a bunny with the deep playing soft like that. Now, here's Ball. Coming in off a 10-point game, his last outing. Ucevic setting the pick for Levine. Driving it. Oh! Got to give Levine some love. Many of the dunks he pulls off are just flat out nasty. Let's go now to the sideline and catch up with David Aldridge. Hey, Kevin, thanks. I was able to talk with J.B. Bickerstaff for a minute. Coach was saying that he feels Zach Levine is still underrated as a star in this league. Coach said when Levine gets going, there's just no way to stop him. He's one of the most natural scoring threats in the league. They certainly will respect Levine's explosive offense tonight. Guys? Thank you, David. And in this first quarter, about three minutes played. Lined up there for Allen, and it's Allen slamming it down. Textbook pick and roll from MP, shifting the defense so he can set up a ready shooter. One word you can use to describe Jared Allen, Greg, is efficient. He doesn't waste his chances at the offensive end. I mean, like ever. He's very smart with his shot selection. But don't let that take away from his defense. Allen takes a lot of pride in protecting the rim. Now, MP. After the miss three from Vucevic. The drive by MP. And it's Allen with the jam. And they have owned the paint so far, and the score reflects it. Well, you think defensively that you try to pack in the lane. I mean, but that, then that opens up some opportunities for their shooters. Now, here's Ball. Still looking for his first bucket in this one. Can't cash in on the 10-foot jumper. Now, MP. Here he goes. Mobley wide open. Offline with his three. The Bulls trail by 10. They could use a big shot here to get this offense going. Too many empty possessions. Right now, they need a basket. Allen, a screen on ball. The drive by MP. To the left wing. Oh, 
Clock at six. Throws it up high, and Mobley throws it down. Displaying intensity right off the opening tip, especially on the offensive end. Yeah, they've been very aggressive, and they've taken early control of this game. Now here's Levine. Playing Memphis, he was nearly unstoppable. Vucevic, a screen on Sexton. And then Levine with the jam. You see the screen in row plenty in the day's game. Levine, he's so solid at using it to his advantage. MP with it. Six points for him. Allen, a screen on ball. The drive by MP. Pulls it from 20. That shot off the mark. Now Chicago takes it the other way. And here is Ball. Taking a look at his stats, he's averaging around nine and a half points a game. And the call on the shot that sends also improved greatly all oh, hits them both well he's an all-around player Lonzo's combination of size and playmaking ability in his position is truly unique Now, here's MP. He's as potent an offensive player as you're going to find in this league. He averages almost 30 points a game. And slam dunk by Allen. And you can see Allen's eyes light up when he saw the opportunity for that alley-oop and finishing it off in style. Now, here's Levine. And he's currently averaging more than 26 points a game. Such a force. Now, MP. Allen, a screen on Levine. The drive by MP. Great D that time from Vucevic. Man, you don't see this fella blow many layups. Not against D like that in the way. Left side, Levine. Outside, DeRozan. Good ball movement here by the Bulls. Johnson, the pass to ball. Over Allen. Misses off the right iron. Well, you, you have to like their work on the boards, Kevin, particularly here to start the game. And it's Chicago with the rebound. Got to keep rolling here following the win against Memphis. Remarkable consistency from deep. You can't count on that every game, especially on the road. And they were connecting. And when they're connecting like that, they're hard to beat. Their accuracy from outside, just incredible. Now here's DeRozan. Jared Allen unable to get his last shot to go. And the Bulls with another miss. Cleveland leading by eight. Here's MP. Six points for him. There's the drive. And the dunk by MP. Their play on both ends is going to the Bulls. Y'all aren't that good. We're coming for that lead. Let's it fly. He gets it to fall. That makes it just a single digit lead. Ball's got six. And despite the hot start from beyond, they've gotten away from shooting the triple. So on the floor for Cleveland. Mobley and Allen, the two big men inside. Sexton and Okoro are your wingmen. And it's MP in at the point. As Allen continues to develop his offensive game, he continues to earn the trust of his teammates. We're just over two and a half minutes into the second quarter. Vucevic setting the pick for White. And it's sent back by Allen! MP with it. He's got 10.
Allen, a screen on ball. The drive by MP. Yeah, how about MP just showing off right there? Give this guy a launching pad. Man, the sky's the limit. And on our sideline, our reporter, David Aldridge. Hey, guys, MP in the last game against the Nets put on a show. He contributed 61 points, and that scoring outburst set a new season high for him in what became a great exhibition on his part. He put up numbers that really jumped out in the box score. A very solid performance. Kevin, we'll see what he's got in his arsenal tonight. Thank you, David. You're right. He was a one-man wrecking crew in that one. Yeah, he was not going to let them lose that game. But we'll see if he comes in with that same attitude tonight. No, I think he will because he takes being a leader seriously. And it shows in how he approaches things at both ends of the floor. Sexton finds MP. Allen, a screen on ball. Wound up there for Allen. Stolen by ball. On the wing, Johnson. Ball surveying the defense. To the left side wing. Six to shoot. Johnson, the pass to Vucevic. Shoots over Mobley. And it's Vucevic missing. And so, MP will bring it up for the Cavaliers. The Oklahoma City Thunder will be in town for the next one. And that's the first game in a string of three straight at home. Outside for Sexton. And air balls the triple. That one was way off. Vucevic, a screen on MP. Ball, the pass to Vucevic. And it's sent back by Allen. Now, here's MP. He lobs up the alley -oop pass, and Mobley throws it down. That kind of play really shows MP's character. This guy's a showstopper, but also unselfish. And DeRozan kicks to White. Vucevic is screen on Sexton. White finds ball. DeRozan with it. The 15-footer, he scores the basket. That's field goal number three for him. I mean, it took him a long time to get into the flow of the game, but the points are starting to come for him now. The drive by MP, and then jammed down as he goes right over to Kola Vucevic. I'll tell you what, it's some role MP's on a day. His focus has been unreal. Whenever the D's made an adjustment, it's like he knew it was coming. Just keeps pouring it on, pouring it on. And with that shot, the Cleveland Leaders get down to just 12 points with the basket from DeMar DeRozan. And DeRozan, a free agent this past offseason, took his time to find the right fit in terms of who he would sign with, ultimately choosing Chicago in a big victory for the Bulls. Rising up with ease there. When MP gets great inside positioning, he leaves no room for error with the slam. DeRozan with it. And Allen picks him up defensively. Paul with a wide open look. Misses the three. Just a solid performance on the interior. The rebounding has been off the charts. White against MP. He makes his 10th basket of the night from the field. He has missed two shots from the floor. And it's coming easy for them right now. Five baskets in a row in the paint. Ball dishes to White. To the paint. Sexton against Ball. Step back shot. And that one hits back iron. His interior scoring is one of the things that drives their offense. Don't expect him to miss many of those. Johnson sets the screen for Ball. Johnson outside. Right side to Rosen. Allen with the rebound. The Cavaliers leading by 16. Allen a screen on ball. The drive by MP. And it's good. Two points. MP's got 22. And not hard to see why they are giving up points on this run. Just too many good looks from in close. 
Ball with the bucket. That added muscle, helping Lonzo there. Look at In that first half, he was a hot knife, and the defense was butter. Sliced right through them. He did a great job of attacking the seams, getting to the rim, and then finishing strong. Third quarter action getting rolling right now. Brought to you by Gatorade. All fueled up and ready to go. Here's who's on the floor. Taking a look at the Bulls. In the backcourt, it's Ball and Levine. DeRozan out there with Johnson. And it's Vucevic in at the center position. Here's MP. Up and in on the way. He's got 24. That's just a high percentage look from MP. I mean, good coaching. You want to put the talent on your roster in a position to succeed. And stolen by MP. And there's the drive. The shot. No good. Excellent D there from Ball. Second half just getting started. About a minute played. Johnson with a screen on Sexton. Six on the shot clock. Johnson the pass the ball. Three-pointer. Allen with the rebound. Allen's got rebound number 10 tonight with that last one. Ball against MP. Going inside, and the dunk by MP. And one step ahead of the defense with that solid screen. And then, Greg, the monster dunk to finish it off. Oh, come on, guys. Someone has to rotate over. Defensively, that's just poor communication. And it's DeRozan missing. The edge on the glass is the difference. It's allowed them to build this lead. A Coro shot is off. And here's Levine, who brings it up for the Chicago Bulls. It's a 16-point game. Two minutes into the second half of play now. Ball with it. He's picked up by Mobley. And, Greg, you made your money on the defensive end. What was the toughest kind of player to defend? A one-on-one -on -one guy or a, or a constant movement type of player? Uh, I've always will say that it's harder to guard movement. You know, as a defender, you're, you drill a lot about starting the basketball. But when a guy is great without it, man, that is the hardest job you can have defensively. And keeping us updated from the sideline, let's swing it over to David Aldridge. Thank you, Kevin. After making the finals four straight years from 2015 to 2018, there have been some lean years lately for the Cavaliers. Over the last three seasons, they've only won a couple more games than they did in a single season, their title season of 2016. Coach J.B. Bickerstaff says the losing is tough on everybody, but I look forward to the journey ahead. Kevin, back to you. What do they say, D.A.? The journey is the reward. Thanks. Ball, the pass to Vucevic. Allen with the rebound. As you could ask for, around 80% on the season. Wade, he's checked in for the Cavaliers. Well, you know Zach Levine really earned his way to all-star status. I mean, it took a lot of effort, but he has developed himself into an impressive scoring machine. And there's the bucket from MP. MP's got eight points here in this quarter. His individual effort has been outstanding tonight, and it's helped him grab the lead. And here's DeRozan. He's got eight. There's Vucevic. Good. And it's DeRozan picking up the assists. Vucevic has got five points so far. Now, here's MP. Takes it inside, and he's fouled pretty hard on that shot, but he's got the chance. Carry their team. He's off on the first. And what I like about MP, it's the confidence with which he plays. He feels like he can go at anyone 
in the league. And Cleveland making a change here. Markinen's checked in. Good on the second free throw. And so here is Chicago, trailing by 13. Oh, and they get in the way of the alley-oop. Not to be. Good play defensively. MP with it. Now guarded by Ball. MP, no good. Now Chicago's gotten the three-point bug tonight. They've taken 15 shots outside the arc. Six of 15. Out of hand on it. With the drive, and MP throws it down. Oh, he just punches that one down with a fury. He rubs it in a little deeper with the hanging finish. Now here's Vucevic, guarded closely. Levine dishes the ball. Vucevic setting the pick for ball. Five on the clock. Over Mobley. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. The Cavaliers leading by 17. So on the floor for Cleveland. Sexton and Okoro are your wingmen. Mobley and Allen, the two big men inside. And it's MP in at the point guard position. Oh, let's go home. That was just <laughs> ridiculous. I do not remember the last time I saw a dunk like that in a game. Ball kicks to DeRozan. Back to Ball. Shot clock at five. Good. And it's DeRozan picking up the assists. And so far, going for more of an inside presence here in the second half, getting away from the three-point shot. Allen, a screen on ball. The drive by MP. And MP throws it down. It puts the D in a tough spot when you have a point guard who can throw it down. He really does, GA. He really does put pressure on you. And guys, it's clear, though, he enjoys showing off his athleticism. The D can't give him these opportunities. Horton Tucker, the pass to DeRozan. Shoots over a Coro. DeRozan's shot is off. Plus eight in the rebound differential. One more reason why they're in control. About a minute and a half into the fourth quarter now. The drive by MP. And then jam down as he goes right over to Kola Vucevic. Kevin, is there another player out there capable of moves as stunning mm. as that? A handful at the most. He is an elite company. Now, Okoro back to MP. Greg, you've got the unique opportunity right now to watch your son Cole follow in your footsteps. What has changed for players now versus when you play? Well, I, I think the players today are so much smarter, and they prepare to be pros at such an earlier age. And honestly, I think that's one of the advantages our league has. You know, you don't have to teach these guys responsibility. You may have to teach them the game, but they are ready, willing, and able to work to achieve their goals. Ball with it. Guarded now by Sexton. Here's Horton Tucker. At the elbow, Vucevic. Shot to stop the run. Not enough on that one as it misses. Allen, a screen on ball. Wound up there for Allen. Throws down the alley-oop slam. And they're balanced on that for the ball. Here's DeRozan. And... 
Shoot two. You know, he said, you have to be able to take criticism if you want to be great. Use the negative energy to become something more than you thought you could do. Now on a screen on ball, the drive by MP. And back in the day, Greg. That's a foul? Sorry, I thought this was a contact sport. My bad. MP. When I had to invest $200 million in a player, I want to do everything I can to prolong my investment. And the reality is we've got our stars playing at unprecedented lifts at higher levels later in their career. So I'm all for doing what we can to prolong the careers of our very best player. Catching up on the changes for Chicago. Johnson, he's checked in for Jones, and Levine subbed in for Brown. Here's Vucevic, and the Bulls with another miss. And a big lead for them on both the scoreboard and the backboard thus far. Allen, a screen on ball. Kicks it out to Love. Off target from outside. And they had some botched coverage that turned into no coverage. Here's Ball. Cavaliers with the rebound. Allen's got rebound number 17, if you can believe that. He's not using his head this quarter. He's got to get back to finding high percentage shots. The drive by MP. Love wide open. He fires. No good on the three. Ball with it. Shot clock at six. Here's Vucevic. Boy, you can see his struggles from the field, and I think it's really starting to get to him. I don't know if it's been the main factor, but this off night has definitely been one factor here. The drive by MP. That one good for two. MP's got 42 in the game. He's kept the integrity of their offense tonight by moving and cutting and scoring every time they've needed him to. Levine with it. Started now by Sexton. Levine's shot is off. I love to see the defense exhibit some passion in, in protecting the rim right there. Vucevic against MP. For three, Love. Chicago grabs the miss. Bowles got his fourth rebound in this one. It's been a really tough quarter for him. I mean, he cannot get his shots to drop. Pass to Vucevic. And the layup's good off the glass. Vucevic has got 11 points here in just the second half. And they're passing the ball very crisply here. Love with the screen on ball. The drive by MP. Love, no luck. They haven't needed him as much as I thought they would tonight. Pass the ball. We've heard the calls for more diversity among head coaches, Greg. With the turnover this offseason came a lot of opportunity. And Kevin, that's really what it's all about, right? The league's values of diversity and inclusion have been really pushed to the forefront. And I think that's one why, reason why our game is so popular globally, because it is so inclusive. It's a pick by Love. The drive by MP. Love kicks to MP. Love with the screen on DeRozan. And the basket by MP. MP's got 44. He's putting the hammer down. Dominant quarter for him, trying to push out that lead. Guys are looking for a spark here. Yeah, a cold stretch offensively, for sure. DeRozan hits the front of the rim and out. Cleveland leading by 23. Yo, 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 yo. And here is MP. And Love has it in the corner. Good, and the assist goes to MP. MP's got 10 assists here tonight. So active. 
Ball, the pass to DeRozan. Ujovic setting the pick for DeRozan. And it's sent back by Allen. P, you feeling good? Yeah, I am. I'm good, you man. You sure? You know, you look like you need some fresh air. Maybe you should go take a walk. No, I'm good, bro. I actually, was actually, you should go put on a fresh new outfit, you know, something flashy. Let the people see how you feeling. So this like a, a striker pose thing and not like a mental health thing? <laughs> like, I'm just saying, man, every time you step outside looking the way that you do, people are talking. They're posting pictures. <laughs> First comment's always something like, oh my God, there's MP. Second comment, look at what he's wearing. Straight fire. Dog, every time that happens, we get one step closer to changing the game. I'm just saying, think it over. Stay focused on your workout. All right, everyone, bring it in. Great game last night. One of the best I've been a part of. Let's keep that focus and energy going in today's practice. Aim to be great. We really need to push the tempo and get out in transition more. All right, let's work on moving the ball quickly in transition.
get the next Race for MVP already heating up, Doris. Here if you go. look five years out, who do you see in that competition? Boy, be a great question, and so much is about health and can your team be successful, but you have to watch names like Luka Doncic, like Zion Williamson, Ja Morant, all electric in terms of what they bring between the lines. Well, MP in the last matchup against the Bulls was a man on a mission. He ended up with 44 points and moved the ball well, feeding the hot hands. Monster production. He was focused. He was relentless. Everyone is still buzzing about it, guys. Thanks, Allie. Absolutely. He was a one-man show in that one, Grant. Yeah, he was not going to let them lose that game. We'll see if he comes in with that same mentality tonight. One of the things I like about this guy, he's able to up the intensity whenever needed, and players really feed off his energy. Something to know about MP and his off-the-court interest. Grant, he's an avid follower of the fashion industry. Yeah, B.A., I mean, more and more NBA stars are getting interested in the world of fashion. I'm curious to see how far MP will pursue this passion of his. Well, Sexton showing that he's more than just a jump shooter. Very comfortable on the interior against size. Here's Roby. His offense has been solid, scoring around 11 and a half points a game. Out of bounds. It'll be Cleveland ball. That looks like a lack of... Good DMP. Good hands. And here's MP. Coming off a solid outing against Chicago. First quarter at about a minute and a half in. Allen with a screen on Gilgis Alexander. MP with it. Now Favors defending. Four on the clock. Mobley, no good. Now Gilgis Alexander. He's a tough guy to check. Averaging almost 28 points a game. Cash is in the 12-footer. Well, Shea Gilgis Alexander making the mid-range look effortless right there. There is no doubt this guy is a three-level scorer. Allen with a screen on Gilgis Alexander. MP drives in. Oh, and the dunk by MP. Are you serious? That is some power from a point guard. Oh, I love backcourt players with some ups. We know versatility is huge in this game. Just a tremendous job finishing that play. Wow. Now here's MP. And on offense, he's been a force. Scoring over 30 a game. Going inside. Shots blocked. And a little over two and a half minutes gone here in the first. Pass to Giddy. To the middle. And that one's good. Gilgis Alexander. Gilgis Alexander's got his second bucket on the night. Well, because of his length, Shea Gilgis Alexander has no issues operating near the cup. Gilgis Alexander against MP. Drives to the hoop. And MP throws it down. Now that's how you capitalize on a screen. Yeah, good positioning, too. Gave him a clear path to the hoop. Where? 
was the defense. No fighting through the pick, no rotation. My goodness. And he gets it to go. First quarter of action, just under three and a half minutes played. Now here's MP. Driving in, and MP throws it down. What a move by MP. I'll tell you, you need a little bit of creativity off the bounce, and MP, yeah, that's in his game. Dort with it. Well, he hasn't put up any points yet in this one. Outside for Gilgis Alexander. And from the field after that one, three for four now. Boy, his shot looks deadly right now. Already he's hit three of four to start. Allen with a screen on Gilgis Alexander. The drive by MP. Oh, and the dunk by MP. <laughs> wow, did you see that? I mean, MP throwing it down off the bounce. Watch out. Takes it inside. And slam dunk by Gilgis Alexander. Wow. I'll tell you, such an advantage having a playmaker who can get up to the rim and finish. Now that is what every team wants. Oh, you love it. Fearless, aggressive, leaving no doubt whatsoever. That's oh, just tremendous length. Exceptional hands. Jared Allen, nice and easy. Dort for three. And no good. So Cleveland will take it the other way. Their last encounter in Oklahoma City, where they were able to handle the Thunder. In their last game against this opponent, they secured the win because their second unit really stepped up. Certainly something to keep an eye on. We'll see how the rotations go this time out. Every night it seems to be different. Now here's Sexton. Oh, Favors with a block. I think you want to see more of this from Derek Favors. You love to see him be aggressive and try to send shots back. Here's Roby. Deflected! And he's able to get it back. Gilgis Alexander into the lane. And slam dunk by Gilgis Alexander. And despite the size mismatch, getting a little aggressive down there in the paint. Some guys just relish the challenge. Find a way, and he does. Now here's MP. Give him eight points now. And there's a pick. Pass to Mobley. The three from Sexton. The shot won't fall. So Oklahoma City will take it the other way. They're moving on after the tough loss they took at the hands of the Hornets. It's always hard to get a win on the road, especially when you show zero energy on the defensive end. One thing you know, Greg, is you've got to pack your defense in the suitcase if you're going to win on the road. Favors hits them both. Here's MP. Trailing by two. To the paint. Here's Allen. And it's Allen who slams it home. Boy, you can't leave someone wide open on MP's team because this guy will notice and make a play. And you know, Grant, with Baisley's path to the league, initially wanted to go to the G League, but backed out of that. Yeah, a lot of twists and turns on his journey. More and more players now bypass college. Baisley took a risk, and it seems to have paid off for him. Oh, and he blocks it off the glass. Wow. And he drives in. And MP throws it down. If MP's got a chance to do some damage at the rim, you better believe he's going to take it. He's not a guy who just plays it cool. Here's Jerome. Boy, no scoring yet from him, but that's likely to change. Gilgis Alexander, rejected by Allen. 
Left side, Sexton. And the rebound goes to the Thunder. Not a lot falling for him in this quarter. He's got to stay aggressive, try to break through. See if you can get an easy opportunity. Pass to Dort. Gilgis Alexander against Sexton. Favors with a screen on Sexton. And the ball out of play. The Cavaliers will have it. Time called here. The Cavs decide to talk. D up on him and don't let him breathe. All right? You got it, Coach. The Cavaliers leading. Mobley and Allen together in the middle. MP is out there with Ricky Rubio. And it's Okoro in at the three. So that's who's on the floor for the Cavs. MP drives in. Here's Mobley. The putback. Great positioning on the putback. Just great positioning to get the rebound and get it back up. Gilgis Alexander against Rubio. Inside. Back to Gilgis Alexander. Dort for three. Knocks down the long J. So Dort's got his first bucket of the game, and he's on the board for three. And here's MP. He's got 10. And there's the drive. Here's Rubio. And the three off target. Well, we got a close game here in Cleveland. And at home for the next game, it'll be New York pulling in to face them. It'll be the second of three straight games on their home floor. You can see the work Lou Dort has put in to make himself a threat from three. That's a pretty looking shot right there. The drive by MP. Misses from short range. Boy, nine times out of ten, that's going in. I'm sure he surprised himself with the miss. They get the rebound. Giddy. And that misses. That would have put him up. The Cavaliers have gotten only one of four shots to go in. Second quarter of basketball, just over a minute and a half played so far. Boy, it's always fun to watch MP when this guy gets his rhythm. The confidence is there. The offensive arsenal is ready to match it. Rubio against Gilgis Alexander. The three ball. The rebound by Allen. Allen's got five rebounds in the game. Risky strategy here. I mean, shifting their offense more to the outside. Mm, we'll see. Pass to Rubio. Shot clock at five. Over Gilgis Alexander. No good off the glass. This has been a close game in a lot of ways, but they do have an edge on the boards. Here's Giddy. Let's the three fly. And the rebound goes to the Cavaliers. Mobley's got four rebounds in the game. Down low. Oh, it's stolen by Gilgis Alexander. Here's Giddy. And that's out of bounds. Oklahoma City will keep it. Here's Gilgis Alexander. After lighting up the court in the first quarter, he's put up a donut so far in the second. And here in the second quarter, about three minutes played. The drive by MP. Oh, and the dunk by MP. To me, that's about his feel for the game because MP in pick and roll play just reads the defense and makes the right decision. Outside Gilgis Alexander. Over Rubio. And that one's good. Gilgis Alexander. Gilgis Alexander's got 12 points. Well, the versatility he possesses makes him a very tough cover, guys. Pass to MP. This one for three. Here's Allen. Lays it up and banks it in. He has six. We've seen that more than once today. An effortless basket inside. 
Gilgis Alexander up top, covered by Rubio. Oh, nice finish from the low block. That one's good. Because Shea Gilgis Alexander has an array of moves, this guy can get going offensively, and he's starting to cook a little bit. Dort for three. The rebound by Allen. Allen's got his eighth rebound here tonight. Gilgis Alexander against MP. Allen with a screen on Gilgis Alexander. And MP throws it down. Wow! Always fun to see point guards who can elevate above the rim like that. Oh, a strong mindset and even stronger finish. Boy, it's incredible how much explosive scoring ability can come from the lead guard position. That is a big time play. Outside for Gilgis Alexander. Six to shoot. Unloads from 13. Misses off the left iron. Cleveland has gone 0 for 2 from outside in the second quarter. Now MP. 16 points for him. Here's Baisley. And so he draws the foul. Headed to the line to shoot him. Let the boys play. Stop trying to take over the game. That one's no good. Interesting, Darius Baisley skipped college. He used the year in between high school and the NBA to train on his own. That's a different path. The drive by MP doesn't go for him. So Oklahoma City will take it the other way. Following this one, they get to host the Bulls. And that kicks off a string of three home games for them. Well, on the catch and shoot, you've got to be shot ready. And Gilgis Alexander showing off his pretty form. Allen with a screen on Gilgis Alexander. Driving to the basket. And MP throws it down. Just great offense. The screen freeing him up for the slam. Hey, without that screen, he doesn't get a clean look at the rim. Boy, that's a play you just practice time and time again. And that's the result of the work put in. And his fantastic performance from the last game has carried over to tonight. Now, I think that's the one thing every player is searching for, consistency. They're giving this guy a chance to carry the offense once again. Allen with a screen on Dort. Here's a Kuro. Got a hand on it. And here's the fast break. Baisley, good. Baisley's got five points. And taking a quick look here at the hustle stats for Oklahoma City. Guys, it's been great hustle defense throughout two quarters of play. Contesting everything and racking up the block shots as well. There's something else they've done right from the get-go tonight is run. So much of their offense coming on the fast break. Sexton misses. For Oklahoma City, they've gotten seven of 16 shots to go in the second. Here's the teardrop, and Gilgis Alexander lays it up and in. Now it's a... Alexander has been exceptional here, guys. I love how effortlessly he scored. The game just comes so easy for him. And let's see if he continues that trend the rest of the way. He certainly has the talent and the endurance to do just that. Taking a look at Oklahoma City. Isaiah Roby out there with Derek Favors. Then it's Shea Gilgis Alexander. Then there's Lou Dort. And it's Giddy in at the shooting guard position. Gilgis Alexander passes to Favors. Here's Roby. Boy, he's been patient so far. Nothing yet on the scoreboard. Here's Giddy. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll hit. How the heck is that a foul? And 
he makes the first but misses the second. The battle of the boards has been something to watch. Here's Sexton. It's rebounded by Oklahoma City. Roby's got nine rebounds now. Gilgis Alexander against Sexton. Here's Favors. Outside for Gilgis Alexander. Goes back up. And they're going to count that bucket. And they'll send him. That's good from Favors. A little over a minute gone here in the second half. Now here's MP. Give him 20. On the take. Outside for Sexton. Off the mark there with a three. Third quarter action and just under three and a half minutes have passed. MP with it. 22 points for him. Six on the shot clock. Cleveland needs to get off a shot. Mobley, no good. For Oklahoma City, they've gone four of six from the floor in this third quarter. Gilgis Alexander on the wing. And he lays it up and in. And now a four-point Thunder lead. Well, obviously, the defense has not been great this half, and you've got to be able to address this quickly. MP with it. Now Gilgis Alexander defending. Oh, and the dunk by MP. Wow. I'll tell you, such an advantage having a playmaker who can get up to the rim and finish. Now that is what every team wants. Oh, you love it. Fearless, aggressive, leaving no doubt whatsoever. And he recovers it. Pass to Giddy. It's Dort on the wing. And again, Oklahoma City with a triple. Being ready on the catch, such an important skill. And Luke Dort's confidence really starting to grow. MP against Gilgis Alexander. And there's a whistle. That's going to go on. So it's the Cavaliers now. It's a five-point game. MP up top. Favors covering. Clock at six. MP, the pass to Sexton. I'll tell you, no matter what he does, he can't find his rhythm, and you get the sense he's starting to press a little bit. Here's Dort. They get it back. Roby outside for Dort. 4-3. It's rebounded by Cleveland. I'll tell you, it has not been this guy's best night, but the teammates have been there to pick up the slack. Love it. The drive by MP. And MP throws it down. And you have to love it. The floor general taking things into his own hands. Just the aggression they're looking for, man. Boy, and not just the aggression, the ability to get to the rim, but how about the finish with intention? Oh. Allen with a screen on Gilgis Alexander. Into the lane. And it's Allen who slams it home. There's nothing like a big man with agility. Jared Allen operating well in the pick and roll right now. Pass to Favors. And here's Dort. Outside Gilgis Alexander. Over MP. There's another block. A defensive stalwart so far. That's six blocks. Protecting the rim well. Love the hustle. Right wing. Here's Akuro. Dort defending. Pass to Mobley. For the lead. The rebound by Favors. Favors got his seventh rebound of the game with that last one. MP against Gilgis Alexander. To the inside. Here's Giddy. Cavaliers with the rebound. Allen's got 11 rebounds in the game. Here's MP. 
Allen a screen. MP with it. Now Favors defending. And it's Allen who slams it home. Great game for him. Double-double now. All aspects of MP's game are important, but boy, do they love seeing this guy run the pick and roll as effectively as he does. Outside, Gilgis Alexander. Pass to Dort. Six to shoot. And that'll be Oklahoma City's ball as it goes out of bounds. Thunder able to keep possession. Now a timeout call by Oklahoma City. The next few minutes. That's what will decide this game. So step up. This is your moment, not theirs. Inspiring words, guys. Thanks for that, Allie. Mobley and Allen together in the middle. MP is out there with Colin Sexton, and it's Windler in at the three spot. That's the five for Cleveland right now. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the action. What? The Come on, Rev. That's a soft foul. And drops. He ties it up. Here's MP. He takes it in. And a foul called on the way up. You're winning! Yay! Time to throw a parade! And he makes a first. And the Cavaliers making a change here. Okoro's checked in. And both free throws good for MP. And after attempting no free throws in the first half, now he's putting the defense back on its heels. Dort outside. Tough break for the defense. I mean, he took the hit. Just under two and a half minutes gone by now in the final quarter. Pavers with a screen on Sexton. The drive by Dort. Rejected by Allen. And he gets it back. Four on the clock. Here's Giddy. Obviously, the scouting report on Okoro starts with his defense. He's physical, he's relentless, and he gives maximum effort. On the wing, MP. Favors covering. MP shot is good. This guy is cooking right now. He is leading them on the offensive end as they remain in front here. Outside, Gilgis Alexander. Pass to Favors. Dort, left side. Jacks up a three. Nails it from beyond the arc. And the Thunder lead by one. Oh, this one has turned into an absolute nail-biter. Yeah, at this point, you almost expect it to come down to the last possession. Oh, and the dunk by MP. Woo-wee! What a big finish out of the backcourt. That might be exactly what they needed at this point of the game. Boy, as tight as this one is, that's a statement play saying, hey, listen, we're not here to back down from you guys. Floats one. And there's the play by Gilgis Alexander inside. Gilgis Alexander's got 10 points here in the second half. Now here's MP. Driving inside. And MP throws it down. In a tight one like this, you have to trust in his ability. Oklahoma City has gotten one of three to fall from downtown here in the fourth. To the right side. To the middle. Favors the pass to Gilgis Alexander. Dort with it. Back to Gilgis Alexander. Goes up from the top of the key. That shot is off. And it's Cleveland the other way. And it's the Thunder with the ball. 
They lead by one. Well, great decision from Dort. If your teammate is open, get him the basketball. Nicely done. They need something good to happen here. Yeah, they've gone way too long without a score. The drive by MP, and he gets that one. MP's got 38 points. And credit his teammates for feeding him all quarter. Pass to Favors. Dort for three. Oh, the Thunder, another three. That's his fifth triple of the night. Two in the first half, three in this one. Huge production. With the drive. And MP throws it down. And just a great screen. And they got a high-powered finish out of it. And my question is, where was the help? Someone rotate over and challenge. And the layup is good off the glass. And the Thunder lead by four. The assist numbers certainly stand out. <laughs> They've really emphasized ball movement here today. MP drives in. And the layup falls. MP's got 42 in the game. I'll tell you, that's about having the proper angle by MP. Nice touch inside. Here's Giddy. Pass to Favors. Outside, Gilgis Alexander. Shot clock at six. Oklahoma City's got to hurry. They got to get up a shot. Oklahoma City, the rebound to the left side wing. Second chance shot. Comes up empty down low. Cleveland has gone 0 for 2 from outside here in the fourth quarter. The three from Okoro. It's rebounded by Oklahoma City. Pass to Gilgis Alexander. Here's Favors. Roby inside. Here's Giddy. Covered by MP. Favors with a screen on MP. Rejected by Allen. Here's Sexton. No! They're unable to get the tying basket there. Here's Giddy. Outside Gilgis Alexander. From about 19. Perfect. Right between the eyes on that one. Gilgis Alexander's got 35 in the game. Well, you love his effort level, right? Particularly when it's winning time. He is going for the finish. Oh, and the dunk by MP. Woo-wee! What a big finish out of the backcourt. That might be exactly what they needed at this point of the game. Boy, as tight as this one is, that's a statement play saying, hey, listen, we're not here to back down from you guys. Oh, what a play. Just calms the block. Going inside. Oh, and the dunk by MP. Look at what he's doing here, and it's hard to imagine him playing much better. Pass to Gilgis Alexander. And slam dunk by Gilgis Alexander. So smooth, so pretty off the dribble drive. Shea Gilgis Alexander doing work. Allen with a screen on Gilgis Alexander. The drive by MP. Oh, and the dunk by MP. Impressive one-hand slam right there, B.A. Man, as long as he's confident about it, I'm good with it. Maybe use two hands next time. He knows where he is. Favors with a screen on MP. Drives to the hoop. And slam dunk by Gilgis Alexander. Such a smoothness and ease to the way Shea Gilgis Alexander plays. What a pretty drive. Makes it look easy. Allen with a screen on Gilgis Alexander. MP drives in. Oh, a clear foul there on the missed shot. More, more than the other team. <laughs> So the first one drops, and that narrows the gap to one. And that one goes in. Two from the line that time. Now this game has the feel that it could come down to the wire, so that is just the kind of success they need to have at the foul line. Gilgis Alexander attacking. 
That one goes in. Gilgis Alexander's got 41. His nimbleness makes him a unique threat at the rim. Gilgis Alexander against MP. And he drives in. Oh, connects again. <laughs> That's the bank, <laughs> And that one falls. That puts him up one point in the game now. That's exactly what this team needs right now. Completing the end one. MP against Gilgis Alexander. Favors with a screen on MP. Gilgis Alexander into the lane. Money. <laughs> Great to see guys who don't back down under pressure. To me, more often than not, when you attack, good things happen. Allen a screen. Driving inside. Now a timeout call by Oklahoma City. Seconds left in the fourth quarter. Gilgis Alexander up top. Dort for three. Sexton grabs the board. Dort with a steal. Here's Giddy. And he sinks it. Ooh, a clutch bucket. A defensive stop. against Gilgis Alexander. MP drives in. Yet another bucket. In this game, he gets physical. Free throw good. MP. Now that's how you capitalize at the line. As long as they play good defense, they should have this win sealed. Oh, that shot! All right, let's go with Frank. I feel like it's been a minute since we talked. What's on your mind? Hey, congrats on the win. But but it looked like the other team had your defense figured out, though. What do you think? Yeah, yeah, it was a good game, and it made some tough shots, too. I mean, look, sure, we could have probably shut them down a little sooner, but we got the stops when we needed them, Frank. Yeah, yeah, but what role did Luck play tonight, though? Man, Luck has nothing to do with it. Over a long enough time period, the percentages, they just don't lie. We were the better team, and we proved it tonight. Okay. All right. Thanks. 